their struggle to break out into the mainstream, many will try anything, including Satan worship, or selling their souls to the devil, to achieve success. I come from the school of thought, there's just, there's just some things that the, that, the, that the public just shouldn't know. We'll do it. Why are you still out here? Well, it goes back to the destiny thing. I mean, I made a bargain with it, you know, a long time ago, and I'm holding up my hand. What was your bargain? To get where um, I am now. Sh should I ask who you made the bargain with? <laughs> with, 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 you know, with the chief, uh, chief commander. On this earth? <laughs> and in this earth and in, uh, and in a world we can't see. The exact course of events leading up to the death of Michael Jackson remain unclear. While an autopsy has been carried out, doctors still can't yet establish an actual cause of his death either. I was only allowed to say that I was blessed, which is good because I, I say that to yeah. this day that I, I'm blessed. But why of, not lucky? What, what's wrong with lucky? Well, I don't know. I think my mom probably said it sounded like Lucifer. Is that crazy? <laughs> What's up everybody, welcome back to another video. Now today is something very, very interesting and I know I haven't posted a video in a long time, but seriously, I've really gotten the motivation to do it again, like for real, like I've always just wanted to make some videos again and I just haven't been in the spot to do it. I haven't known what to post, but I finally found out a series I want to do and this is the first video of that series. So if you guys do, I'm going to enjoy this video. Uh, what the fuck? <laughs> if you guys do, <laughs> If you guys do go on to enjoy today's video, make sure to smack a like on it, you know, and also subscribe to the channel. I'm doing a giveaway on Snapchat right now. Uh, you gotta be following me on Snapchat, and also, I'll ask to see if you like this video. Um, it really means a lot to me, guys, if you also like this video as well, because, you know, it's my first video back, and I gotta get back into the sub box, you know, because I hadn't posted. It's gonna take a long time for me to get back to where I was. Part of my hair, by the way, it looks fucking stupid. But yeah, leave a like on my Snapchat for a giveaway. I'm gonna be doing it on there, you guys know I don't fake giveaways. Fuck all that bullshit. Follow me on there, follow me Instagram. Instagram, do all that stuff. Let's get straight into the video. So today we're gonna be talking about is why Drake and other rappers may be dying. Now, it's a very touchy subject because obviously we don't want anyone dying, period. Nobody needs to die. Obviously not Drake or anybody, this is not confirmed. I just put that in there because you know, he's one of the more popular ones and he represents a lot of rappers now. So hopefully nobody dies, um, but yeah. Very, very, very scary stuff. Now, today we're gonna be talking about is the topic of selling souls. Now, there's been a ton, a ton of people even in the pop industry, talking about the possibility of them selling their souls, such as Katy Perry. Oh, we're on block. Like, I never saw any music videos or anything, unfortunately. Um, but I remember bringing it home. It was uh, kind of like an almost famous moment. Like, I had to smuggle it in my knapsack, going straight directly into my room, and then um, pulling it out. And as I was pulling out the CD, well, needless to say, sold my soul. You're doing really well now, but didn't you release a CD like almost 10 years ago? Um, yeah, I mean, I released a gospel record when I was 15 um, because I grew up in uh, you know, a household where all I ever did was listen to gospel music and my parents are both traveling ministers and so I kind of sang about you know, what was going on in my life at 15 and that's how I got introduced to the music industry. Because I swear I wanted to be like the Amy Grant of music. Yeah. <laughs> but it didn't work out, and so I sold my soul to the devil. So I sold my soul to the devil. So I sold my soul to the devil. And just like a crap ton of people, like Lil Uzi, Nicki Minaj, like I don't know, it's just been all around hip hop. That's been the thing about hip hop. You make it, you make it out the slums, you know what I'm talking about? You're poor at first. You automatically blow up out of nowhere. For instance, Cardi B, she's hinted to being an Illuminati at first. Bro, I'm not even fucking joking about this shit. Like, she really, real deal be about that Illuminati shit. But she, you gotta think about her for a second. Like, she was nobody a year ago. A year and a half ago, two years. Out of nowhere, she's one of the top female artists making music. She is a absolute millionaire out of nowhere. Like, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, this is kind of weird. So the whole reason why I'm even making this video is because you guys have obviously probably seen a video of Lil Uzi saying all that shit on stage, which is really scary. If you haven't seen the clip, uh, here's to refresh your memory. Hold on, let me explain something to them real quick. Before everybody starts screaming and saying, oh, like I told y'all earlier, you motherfuckers have entered the rapture. And if ain't nobody flying up to heaven right now, obviously all y'all motherfuckers going to hell. Right with me. So, let's get it. 
Oh, you already here. I'm so sorry. You can't get out. You're stuck. It's over. You heard the song a million times and you didn't even know. That's fucked up. But I still love you anyway. No, it's okay. It's whatever. You still love me? You do? That's why I love you, because you don't judge me. I love you. Scary as fuck, dude. Like, that shit is wild. When I saw that, I was texting my friends. I was like, dude, this shit's wild as fuck. I can't believe he's saying this shit on stage. Like, you know, that's gonna turn a crap ton of people off of his music, including me, bro. Like, I love Uzi, and I'm still gonna mess with his music, but I'm always gonna look at it different, bro, because, like, he's possessing people. Like, that's exactly what that is. He's possessing people. And when he went on stage, you know, he heard him. He said that he's been listening. Everybody's listened to this song a million times. It's the EXO Tour Life, of course. It was a massive blow-up hit. Everybody's listening to that song. He said that he's sorry they did that. That's fucked up. But you're all going to hell with me. This is the rapture, which is fucking scary. And the whole story about the Antichrist, I don't mean to get into religion, but just for the sake of the video, the whole story of the Antichrist is someone that everybody likes, it's someone everybody watches, it's someone that everybody can believe in when they're talking to. And, you know, of course there's not going to be that set and stone representation of the Antichrist because not everybody likes everybody nowadays. But, I mean, shit, like, everybody listens to Uzi's music most of the time. Like, his album did, like, 131st week, which is insane. Now he changed his profile picture on Instagram to a cult leader. Literally, a cult leader. Say what you want about Uzi. Weird. Did I sell my soul? I sold my soul for you. Now, figure that out. Tell me that I sell my soul, I sold my soul for you. For all you motherfuckers that's on here, that's asking me that I sell my soul, why the fuck is y'all on here if y'all think I sold my soul? Y'all coming right with me, you dummies. There's a lot of videos on YouTube that talk about how to get demons, to sell your soul, to like tutorials on how to do it. It's really not that hard to summon someone upon you, or summon a spirit to do all that shit, which is very fucking weird, dude. Like, I couldn't do that shit. Weird. It's just fucking weird. I don't know what to think about all that shit. It's just weird. Why did I title the video Drake and all these other rappers may be dying soon? Selling your soul is like a contract. You sell your soul, you get what you want. You don't live for that long. If you notice, Michael Jackson, a lot of speculation running around him as he sold his soul. I mean, that shit could, that shit is very well real. Like, Drake, I've seen multiple things, multiple people, even YouTubers talking about the fact that he might have sold his soul. If some of these rappers, if some of these people like Cardi B, Katy Perry, actually really did sell their souls. Roman is a crazy boy who lives in me. And he says the things that I don't want to say. He was born, a f you know, just a few months ago. I think he was born out of rage. He was conceived in rage. So he bashes everyone. He threatens to beat people and he's violent. That must be nice to have like an ignorant loudmouth who you can just sort of blame every... He wants to be blamed. I don't want to blame him. I, I, I ask him to leave, but he can't. He's here for a reason. People have brought him out. People conjured him up. Now he won't leave. Fuck, even Jimmy Carey. Is that his fucking name? Jim Carey? Jim Car Jimmy Carey? I think Jimmy Carey kind of sound live. I think that shit kind of sound live. No, but Jim Carey, I mean, he came out doing the Illuminati sign. And he's, you know, everybody knows about the Illuminati and all that shit. I really think that all that stuff is combined into one. So hopefully this video wasn't all over the place. I know it was probably confusing at first for those that don't know and aren't familiar with the selling your soul thing, but don't stay away from that shit. Don't call a burning man down to the earth to do any of that shit for you, bro. Like, just get it yourself. Grind hard. Um, I'm going to keep sticking with this series if you guys like it. This video is not over by any means. You already, you already know what the fuck going on, bro. Literally, Mr. G Scrubs built out these videos and then another video attached to this video. So, without further ado, enjoy a couple of clips that uh, I've been vlogging over the past couple months and this is just the assortment of a bunch of random ass clips that I had from the trips that I went on. I went to the beach. I went all over the place and um, hope you guys like it.
fucking afraid of heights. What's up, motherfuckers? You know what I'm saying? Mr. G Scrubs back in this bitch. I told you guys I'm gonna start busting again. Uh, right now, if you look at it, I'm in the middle of fucking nowhere. You see, right here, it's fucking woods. Yeah, just, just point it at me. Alright, bye. I pointed at Finder 29 days ago. Do push ups and sit ups. <laughs> Oh, fuck, I was trying to do a slow mo. <laughs> so, made a severe and utter lapse of my judgment. We're in the middle of fucking nowhere, okay? So, I was told there's a cliff over here. Uh, I don't see no fucking cliff, dude. I know there's someone here because everybody comes to this place, but I can't find that bitch, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I'm sweating balls. And, 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 and it ain't cool. Like, look where the fuck we at, dude. We in the, in the middle of god dang nowhere. <laughs> Damn! Holy yeah, shit! Holy <laughs> fuck! Ready? Go ahead, do it, bitch! Hit that hole, me! <laughs> Oh fuck! <laughs> 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 fuck! ABI, right, go on. Breaks his leg. <laughs> Breaks his head on the fucking rock. Fuck! And he's out. Fuck! Uh, I want a um an orange cream slush with a a, a grape. Slush. Fuck! A, a grape slush? Is that what you said? With a grape slush, and that's it. I'm sorry, you said an orange cream slush and a grape slush? Grape slush. Grape. Cream slush or just slush? Just slush. It's gonna be one hit. What's up, fuckers? Uh, I went to Walmart, you know, just do some old little scrub stuff, you know what the fuck I'm saying? Alright, now, get this fine ass bitch, you won't believe it. Fine ass bitch. Motherfucker. And I was thinking, look, like, look at the fucking car, dude. I got shit all over the truck and stuff. You know, I mean, what better way to cover this shit up with this, this a fucking fine bitch on the, the hood? Look at this shit. Fuck off. Look at this shit. Look at this shit, bitch. I learned this in art school how to. Uh, ah, fuck! Hi. Oh, what the fuck? It is. Ah, ah, <laughs> fuck! Jesus, God. It sounds like my grandma's fucking truck out here. That shit sucks dick. <laughs> ah, 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 fuck. <laughs> fuck off. Look at that shit. Fuck. Get real with your chief. I fuck on that Thursday. Ain't no love in this world. To everybody wanna hate. Drop the band on the belt. So I don't say. Work it eight days a week. I How you feel about this, this Louis? <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? The beat ain't on. <laughs> the beat, the beat ain't on, bro. Right, here we go. Go ahead and try that shit. You can't try to fucking record. <laughs> this is gonna be so funny. You gotta ride the beat down. You gotta ride it, bro. Yeah. Good job, yeah, brother. I don't give a fuck, ho. Yeah, I don't give a fuck, ho. Yeah, I don't give a fuck, ho. Yeah, I don't give a fuck. Can you put this shit on for me? Oh, you got this mall and it's the kids' side. What Place. Fucking pussy. You won't believe it. They're all virgins. They're just pan around. Look at this shit. Vir all of them are fucking virgins. <laughs> <I get it. laughs> Whatever the fuck this shit is. Look at this shit. Look at this shit. Mm hmm. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure to slap a like on it. Follow me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Twitter. All will be linked down below in the description. If you guys want to see any more videos like this, leave a like on it. Tell me in the comment section below. I know you guys have missed these videos and missed my videos in general. I'm going to be going back out in public and doing all that fun shit. I'm actually going to start traveling real soon, going all these different places because I've done everything in the city that I'm in, bro. Memphis, I've conquered. I've literally done everything in the city. Everything. I've made a video everywhere. So I think we're going somewhere really cool soon. So be on the lookout for that. It's going to be 
wild. I literally, I can't wait to show you guys where we're going, but the next stop that we're going to is going to be insane. So, thank you guys so much for the support. I'll see you guys in my next video, hopefully in a, uh, a couple of days. <laughs> I'm having too much fun with this shit. <laughs>